We found a lovely painting as part of our collection. We have several paintings. I'm part of the collection staff here at Conner Prairie. The nice thing is it's uh, not in um, real bad condition, so it just needs a little bit of help. This belongs to the Conner Prairie Museum but uh, it's, it's on long-term loan to the IMA, mm -hmm. and in exchange for that, we're doing the conservation treatment so that um, aesthetically it can improve the painting. It had a, a lot of layers of dirt and soot on the surface and discolored varnishes, and being able to treat the painting, consolidate it, stabilize it, and then remove those discoloring layers, we're able to mm -hmm. look at the painting and, and appreciate it in a, in a better degree. After careful examination, I uh, first started with stabilizing areas of flaking and insecure paint and that was done with an adhesive. Main area, um, there's a, a small crease here, almost almost a tear but not quite all the way through where there was paint flaking around that. And then some of these prominent cracks throughout the painting were a little unstable and had to be, to be stabilized. Once everything is stable, then I could begin working a little bit on the aesthetic treatment which re involved removing layers of dirt and soot. And then now I'm removing the discolored varnish particularly if you look at this pink rose compared to the one that's not cleaned, you can see these cool undertones much more clearly with that yellow varnish removed. So you've got the discoloration from the, the dirt and soot, but these deformations affect how you enjoy the painting. The full process of conservation for this painting will probably be roughly 60 to 80 hours of work. Uh, the artist for this is Severin Rosen, who's very well known for a lot of his still life paintings. And it's wonderful that the IMA can have this on loan. We don't have a Severn Rosen in our collection. So it'll be hanging in the American Gallery starting in June 2010.